guys so today I have swatches of the new ILNP summer 2023 arcade collection there are six polishes in this collection this is the first iteration of their new studio color line which is described as a high performance color coat the studio color line is going to be all cream polishes so there are six polishes here in the debut collection in addition to the cream polishes they also have a new wide rounded paddle brush you can see the old more squared off brush here on the left and the new one on the right the old brush was already pretty wide but now it's just a little bit wider and rounded and the studio color polishes also come in this off-white box versus the black box that the normal ILNP polishes come in so the first polish is called turbocharged and this is is described as an energizing neon orange cream. Oh my gosh, you guys, this one is so good. It's super opaque. The formula is fantastic. It's a really bright, eye-searing neon orange red. Perfectly smooth, self-levels very, very nicely. It was totally opaque for me in two coats. This did dry matte, and I feel like it dried a little bit slow, but not anything egregious. When I started to go in and do my second coat, thinking that it should be ready for a second coat by then, I noticed that it was just starting to dry matte, so it was a little bit slower than I was expecting. This is one of those colors that's really hard to capture. Depending on your camera and your lighting, it's going to range from orange like this to like super neon red. I wore this one already, and here's a photo that I took with my phone outside in direct sunlight, and it looks very red compared to on camera and even in person. So that is two coats of turbocharged. The next polish is called Pixel Pink, and this is described as a pixel perfect pink cream. So the formula on this one is good, the coverage is good, but it's definitely less impressive than turbocharged. It's a little bit sheer, almost leaning a bit crelly, but it is still pretty even. It covered completely for me in two coats, but I do think if you have longer nails or a whiter nail line, thinner coats, any combination of the three, you might end up seeing a little bit of nail line after two coats. So these being called high performance color coats, as well as turbocharged set the bar super high right out of the gate. I was a little disappointed in this one, even though it's not bad polish at all. So that is two coats of Pixel Pink. The next polish is called Retro Teal, and this is described as a time traveling, which is a really lofty claim, teal cream. This one's also fairly sheer. It's crelly, almost leaning into jelly territory. It was a little bit streaky on that first coat, but it did cover completely for me in two. I did use a thicker second coat to get there though, so if you don't like your nail line showing, if longer nails, a wider nail line, do thinner coats, I could definitely see you needing three. I actually almost feel like I can make my nail line out here on the footage, and I didn't see that in person. So that is two coats of Retro Teal. The next polish is called Vapor Wave, and this is described as a radiant neon pink cream. This is another fantastic formula and coverage like turbocharged. That being said, the formulas weren't bad on any of the other ones, but the coverage left a little bit to be desired. This one is fantastic. It's very even, levels itself out really nicely. It also dries matte and a little bit slow, again, just like turbocharged did. This covered completely for me in two coats, no complaints. So that is two coats of Vapor Wave. The next polish is called High Score, and this is described as an electrifying blue violet cream. This one is also, I think, a little bit more in the jelly direction than it is in the cream direction. It's just slightly uneven on that first coat, but not terrible. The slight unevenness did level itself out pretty nicely by the time I got to the second, and the second coat did cover completely. Even though this one started out more sheer, it is a solid two coater. I really can't see anyone needing three coats here. So that is two coats of High Score. And the last polish is called Ink, and this is described as an intense jet black cream. This is just a black cream polish, but it's a really good black cream polish. It is super opaque. I think you could probably get away with one coat. I didn't do one coat here, but I think I could have gotten away with one. I also think you're definitely going to be able to get away with one after you've used this a couple times and it gets just a little bit thicker than it is brand new. Great formula, super smooth, self-leveling easily covered in two coats. We've discussed that already. So a really good black polish. So that is two coats of ink. Turbocharged is definitely my favorite. The formula on this was A+. The color is fantastic. I just, I love, love, love this one. It's the only one out of the collection that I picked up to wear. And you guys know I don't wear nail polish super often because I'm lazy. So it's a big deal when I actually pick up a polish out of a new collection and wear it. So that is the ILNP Arcade Collection for summer 2023. Again, I will link that website down below where you guys can check these out. Hope you enjoyed this one and I will talk to you later.